podcast today we are reacting to Dala and it is a collaboration with an artist named Naeem Daniel, Daniel and it's called Munking Eni Adala Lagu Yang Paling Saru Pawa Ku Boat Huh? Yeah, I know, guys. Yeah. <laughs> it was horrible, all right? The pronunciation was... They did the was, best effort we could. Yeah, it wasn't that um, great. But guys, uh, we are back with Dala, that's you know. That's right. They just came out with a song on September 30th. It wasn't more than, what, a week or, a week I was, or so ago? I was on vacation, and then yep. when I came back, I was like, Nick, we got to check out the new Dala track. Yeah, right. uh, you guys were requesting this as well for uh, us to check this out. So it was only right we go ahead and check out another Dala song so here we are guys but before we get into this don't forget to like, like comment subscribe, subscribe and join la, la familia, familia on the road to 20k but well, let's get into this let's, let's go, go. Right. what's it say in the background oh we missed the background okay Or maybe a love lost song because he's because his um oh yes definitely definitely yeah, yeah, bring it all the way back bring it all the way back yeah, you gotta go all um, the way back I was gonna say it seems like it is a love song but it could also be like a, like a love lost song because he's blindfolded yeah. so it's like I'm blind and I can't see yeah, maybe he's on, maybe he's going on a blind date hey maybe, <laughs> right, there you go uh, I think that's I think that's probably in Malay yeah like the title yeah that's I why that. I couldn't pronounce it either. <laughs> So now I think this is more of a breakup song. Now we got the lyrics breaking it down. And these are really beautiful lyrics, by the way. Yeah. These, 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 this is a very beautiful I mean, song, no matter what. I'm so close to leaving. Yeah, exactly. Like, you know, like, what is he talking about right here? Tears, on a, tears on a pillowcase, stuff like that. Yeah, it's knows? definitely like an emotional song. You can tell by the way that the song has been presented here. Mm -hmm. and, and like the piano and and just the clouds. I can't believe how it's very gloomy, in, too. Like the clouds yeah. are not just like a sunshine or ray. It is like uh, a dark. very dark day. Yeah, yeah. exactly. This is more of like a breakup song. This yeah. is definitely more like talking like, you know, he's saying like he's egotistic and she's saying she's this and it's like, they're really talking about like, you know, just why I can't work and like why they have to go, you know, why, yeah. why they have to Just separate. the ecstatic alone, like it's oh yeah, very gloomy, very sorrow, like they're in the dark days. I mean, this scene right here with all you the know. lights and stuff like that, you know, it's like, it's like they're trying to find light somewhere else. Mm -hmm. It's like they can't find the relationship, so it's like they gotta find light somewhere else. Mm. <laughs> Yeah. 
it's called when it's, but it's like they layer like, oh, what is it called? It's not called a call and response. It's called like when they all, like for example, like one person starts singing like the chorus and then another person follows like a couple beats after it, but they're all singing the, like they're all singing the beginning part and then it all starts kind of sounding like they're all singing different parts of it, but they're singing actually the same thing, just a different timing. I can't remember what it's called. Yeah. Somebody who knows music or who knows singing a little bit better than I do, tell me what that's called. When, oh goodness, I hope, I hope you guys can understand what I'm talking about. song that you ever heard yeah one of the saddest songs <laughs> like, without a doubt yeah this, this is definitely up there man hold up like i didn't i didn't see dollar making a song like this you know because like usually they make songs that like They're more popular they want to show different yeah, side yeah, of you know yeah, i mean exactly. a, a much more a much more you know real side where it's much more you know open and very vulnerable kind yeah. of a thing you know something i mean uh, like everybody they go through ups and downs right the masses yeah. they want it to be something more relatable to everybody I, I really messed with it when she said something along the lines of like, you know, I, I don't know how they want to tell you, it's just out of my control. I was like, damn, like, I kind of felt that, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. you know, you know what's like, it's just not there anymore. It's like, it's out of your, like, you're like, I can't force you, myself like, to feel you, something You can't anymore. feel that, that, yeah. uh, that passion anymore, exactly. you know, it's Passion's something that gone. you can't do. It's, if your heart's saying no, your heart's it. saying no. no. I mean, it, hey, that's, that you gotta put, a, you gotta put an end to it, you exactly. know, which is a matter of fact, like, hey, sometimes you just gotta move on, you know, move yep. forward with life, because... There's a lot of life, a lot of life to live, and if you're just going through something that you're Sadness, not really not feeling good. anymore, then yeah. you're not living the right life. Exactly. Well, guys, this is a great song with Naeem, Danielle, and Dala. Again, I'm not even gonna try and pronounce the title. It was a great song, guys. Yeah. I'm gonna call it the, the saddest song they ever wrote. <laughs> That's <laughs> the name of the song now. The saddest song that they ever wrote. Um, it was amazing. I wonder if this was a collab. Yeah. Or, it, or, or if it was like they collab on like the lyrics as well. No, this is definitely a collab because this is Dala and, and Naeem yeah. Daniel. So Naeem and Daniel is not part of Dala, so it has to be a collaboration yeah. uh, between the two. They probably, I mean, I don't know if Dala's coming out with an album. Maybe this Ooh. is going to be on the, the album, the album as, yeah. you know, with Naeem Daniel as a collaboration or Naeem Daniel's coming out with a an album and this is a new album, album yes. on his. It, does, it usually says featuring, right? Exactly. But, but this, this is like, like both, this of is them. both of them together. Like, you know, yeah. and, uh, sometimes artists have that where it's like, it says this and, and this so and other so. Yeah, but this is like uh, this is like a like a legit collab. They wrote the song together. It's a beautiful song again, guys. If or you maybe, guys enjoyed it. Or maybe this is also a part of a like I said. This reminds me of a song that can possibly in a soap be in a part of a soap opera. Maybe in Malaysia. Definitely. Maybe definitely, like a tola to novella. You know, yeah. like, like we have a, a and, here and, for, yeah. and you know an NBC and ABC and all that. You know, maybe yeah. this is a part of that as well. Who maybe, knows? Who knows? But I guys, mean, you if guys you enjoyed like, this video, know. don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and then go watch this video as well, guys. It just came out a week ago, but only has. A little bit under 200,000 views. Go make sure you go watch this video as well. It's a very beautiful video. It's a very beautiful song. Play it to your ex. You know, send it to him via text. Uh, make them <laughs> make them remember you and miss you. Uh, be toxic, you know. Uh, live that life. No, I'm just playing, guys. <laughs> Until next time, you already know what it is. Peace. Peace.